nightmares in my head I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper Anxiety filling up every space, no privacy Inside Getting off to a flying a start is the goal at the beginning of any group stage. Match day one coming up at the European Championship. Which team will come storming out of the traps today? You're watching EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position. And alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And excited to be bringing you match day one action at the Euros. Striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, must take the lead here. And they have, you've got to say, it has been coming. Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And he makes no mistake with the finish. How can he take them on and beat them? The delivery towards the back post. Very clear who got the last touch. So a corner coming up. It's his curse. Superbly read and executed. Firing it towards goal! And that's a very good parry. Determined defending. Kimmich. And considerable progress made by Gundogan as the attack continues. Well, good effort, but he's placed it wide. Well, the stats confirm it. Germany have been the more dominant team over the last 15 minutes. And with it, have created some great openings. And certainly look as though they get another before too long. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Teammate in support. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And teammates around him. Takes the shot. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. In the end. Kai Havertz. Oh, what an opportunity. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And Havertz's finish gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. Well, it's just about a case of wall-to-wall -wall football live with us here on EA TV. And Stuart and I will be with you for this game coming up. Well, not quite accurate enough, but it was a close thing. Tony Kroos. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. But then the one that fails to hit its target. He's got to score! Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. For now remaining here. That's a high-quality pass. A chance perhaps. Goalkeeper got to it. Promising move from Germany. Müller. Müller! And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. 
well as you can see he makes it look easy in the end but I think that's a good finish he'll be pleased with that Kimi Sané Müller and it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And while the finish might not be the cleanest of strikes, it's still good enough to beat the keeper. Callum McGregor. Now with Tierney. And all over here, an acceptable outcome from a German point of view. A victory for them. Well, you might say he's a bit unorthodox, Thomas Müller, but my goodness, he's so very effective, Stuart. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was. Heading for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? We'll have the action on EA TV. And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Jonathan Tarr in central defence. Oh, Derek, there's a chance here. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! And he stopped them in their tracks. And possibilities inside the box. And played in. Just the clearance that was called for. Oh my goodness, you've really got to praise the defence. Corner kick delivery from Tony Cross. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Cleared away. And the final whistle. The big story here. Germany have prevailed. On well, a high level contribution from Kai Havertz. Stuart, sum up for us what most impressed you about his performance. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today. This is when it really hits home. Kickoff time almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams who demonstrably belong on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and the fans wired in? It's coming up live. Sitting alongside me in the comment a look at the starting 11 today is with Nico Elvedi in central defence. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. Well, nothing for the players in the middle to work. Can he make it 1 0? And he puts it away confidently. So the corner played into the box. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Havertz! And he read it superbly. Stefan. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly haven't been at their best today. A wonderful goalkeeping moment. Now, will he be put to the test again here? And that's a very good parry. Kimi. Rudiger. Now with Gundogan. 
Passing it accurately. Who can they pick out? Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. And Kai Havertz cutting infield here. Havertz. There goes the final whistle. And it doesn't get much better than this for them, Stuart, in the group stage. Top spot is theirs. Well, over the course of this group, they've been the best team. They've played some attractive football. They've worked hard to win the ball back. And they deserve to be top dogs. A glittering and meaningful occasion. And all week long, the football chatter has centred around this game and these talented teams. I'm Derek Ray. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Rüdiger plays alongside Jonathan Tah in central defence. And Niklas Füllkrug is up front. Can he make a count? And a decent serve. through here surely a goal on the back of sustained pressure now they deservedly hold the advantage it's an accurate pass from course Havertz well it's all going so swimmingly for them here another goal and now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes Now, this could be productive. Excellent vision. What's he going to do here? Muna. Zane. And still danger here. Kimmich. Promising sequence. Must score! Impudent effort. This to pull one back. And confidently converted. In position. In it goes! To increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? And that will be that, and Germany will be moving on here at the European Championship. Well, in typical fashion, at times Kai Havertz made it look easy. Interested to know what you made of his performance. Now it's for real. The tactics and squad strengths have all been analysed by committed fans and neutral observers. A confrontation that all football lovers will revel in, knowing that we might be about to witness a simply unmissable occasion. Welcome to this quarter-final encounter here at the Euros. My name is Derek Ray and sharing commentary duty with me on this massive occasion is Stuart Robson. Plenty of excitement ahead of this one. It's Italy versus Germany. Well, what a game we have in store for us today, Derek. Both these teams have really good players, slightly different styles of play, and there's so much at stake. Let's hope they both perform at their best here. Well, a really good run. Gundogan! And a goal! They start as they mean to continue. They make the opening statement. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. The danger was very real. Havertz. And Kai Havertz. Havertz! It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. 
Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And what a strike by Havertz. That really is a clinical finish. There was no stopping that. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Has it? Florian Wirtz. David Raum. That's a good pass. Remy Sound defending. Force. Body in the way again. Rudiger. Well, good run and good ball control. And struggling to get the shot off. Well, no danger now. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Horse. Can't miss, surely. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Danger averted for now. Lovely ball over the top. Wonderful chance. Oh, good work by the keeper. Rudiger. Now with Kimmich. And played the pass well. Good vision. Can he get onto this? And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Here it is again. The ball over the top is an absolute beauty. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Going short. Dangerous ball. And touched onto the frame of the goal. Moyes Keane. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Andri. Joshua Kimmich. Kai Havertz. Opportunity. And saved by the keeper. That's Defenders need to cover. Gundogan Florian Wirtz and a fantastic diving save well no danger now this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity oh he saved it well Federico Di Marco Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. And a short corner, let's see. Giving it a try, and there it is, a goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Miller. Pascal Gross. This could be troublesome. And it's very best. You can't argue with that finish. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the finish showed great composure. Just to lift it over the goalkeeper. That's a lovely goal. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Muller. Opportunity for Muller. What a powerful effort, but just wide. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline. So a throw in here. And the full-time whistle and progress to the semi-finals of the European Championship. Assured for Germany. Well, what a good attacking display that was. The passing, movement and creativity were of the highest quality. There'll certainly be confident going into the next round.
We're on the cusp of a colossal occasion. A semi-final encounter here at the Euros. And the nerves must surely be jangling. Who will come out on top? Stay with us, we have live action coming up for you every kick of the ball on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we're at a very important stage of this cup competition, the semi-final stage. Midfield players giving close support to the centre forward and the other two sitting deeper. Also watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. So he's up a thigh in that last tackle. But at the moment, he's staying on the pitch. Keep an eye on him, though. Cheers, Jeff. Viert. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And the keeper more than equal to the task. A long way out. And that is goalkeeping of the very highest order. Corner coming up. Careless, they might be in. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Pulls it back. Havertz! Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. But nothing comes of it. Pascal Gross. And space for Germany in the wide area. Sané. Havertz! And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Delivering it. The first half here comes to an end. Keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Let's see about the delivery. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Nicely timed tackle. And passing it well. Showing patience as well as persistence in the builder. Oh, couldn't pull them level. Well, they certainly should be level. That was a great opportunity to score. Jamal Musiala. Lohian Wirtz. And playing it through. Well, not a million miles away from the equaliser stage of the game. So a half an hour remaining. Decent position for Germany to be in. Oh, Cruz, can he put it away? No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here it is again, and the way they've been playing, that was always going to happen. They've certainly been piling on the pressure here. Tony Kroos, full of ideas on the passing front. Is it going to be? A goal! Well, still a long way to go at this one, but could it be one foot in the final? If the celebrations are anything to go by, the fans believe that's the case. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Kai Havertz. Oh, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Havertz. And he's hit it with authority. 
might still be able to do a bit of damage. But they know that. And steered back under a bit of pressure. Germany could get in behind the defence. Havertz. Keeper did his job to begin with. Germany pushing forward with options available. Great opportunity. Well, dare I say it, that would have finished this as a contest once and for all. Well, you're absolutely right. What a chance to kill the game off. He's got to hit the target there. And peak. And there it is, the full-time whistle. The host nation have done it. Germany through to the final of the Euros. Well, it was far from easy at times. They'll certainly know they've been in a match today, but these are the sort of games you have to get through if you want to win silverware. They've done that, and now they can turn their attention to that final. What a game that should be. This is the day, this is the occasion. The final of the 2024 UEFA European Championship. A chance to write new history, a chance to achieve greatness with the football world eagerly watching. We'll have the action on EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray, sitting high above the halfway line, and next to me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's Germany up against Portugal. Well, there's going to be some... Havertz! The opening goal in the final! And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. He's trying to create something. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. The referee is given a corner. Just can't get it past the wall. Clearance needed to be better. And problem solved for now. Maximilian Mittelstedt. Now with Havertz. Good move in the making from Germany. And stopping the danger. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Bernardo Silva. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. Yep. Just the challenge that was required. Room to roam for Germany on the flank. Well, we had a bit of work to do in getting to that through ball, the goalkeeper. Bernardo Silva. Can they take advantage? Oh, big chance! The net is steering him in the face. It could be up for grabs. On the flank. Now he must favour the cross. And Bernardo Silva has it. Under real pressure here. To Stegen with a great save. Oh, poor from the keeper. Real chance. Oh, a goal! He's equalised. Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, as you can see, he has to get rid of that quicker. That's a poor mistake from the keeper. Bernardo Silva. Onto Ronaldo. Opportunity. It's still alive. But no, that's the end of the move because offside is the verdict. Time for the change now. 
And he's fired over the corner. Not all that convincing defensively. And pushed away to safety. One of those opportunities. Beautiful pass. And he's broken free. Just when we thought the goal would arrive, the grim reality hitting off target. Well, he never looked in full control, did he? That's a poor finish. Otavio. Ronaldo. Leal. Takes the shot. Really in the mood today. That was almost another one. Well, read that pass all the way, cutting it out. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. Can they forge ahead? Oh, yes! The goal that might well be decisive. The goal that could give them the trophy. Well, here it is again. It's a wonderful pass from Sane. And the strike could not get any better. And it threw the back of the ball with such power. Difficult to stop him. Big chance. Is this the moment? It's still alive. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Diaz. And there goes the final whistle. Germany on home soil have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserving champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, Germany! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. doesn't get any better than this, does it? A chance now to celebrate with their own fans. And the fans have also played their part. Just listen to the noise here. Great end to this tournament. Change what you want.